Welcome back to Innocence Tarot. We're going to do another Divine Masculine update. We're going to use Exposed by T. Diva. Once I finish shuffling, I will turn down the music. Let's get into this energy. I'm tired of the usual, tired of the same. I know I can't love you, at least not in a way. Cause baby, I'm too used to you, too used to your faith, too used to your ways, too used to the games that you play. I've been trying, trying to do this for There's something that's been missing that I've been trying to avoid. I don't know what it is, but I know it's not you. Okay, I hope everybody is doing well. Make sure you push that like button, subscribe to the channel would be greatly appreciated. Let me go over the services that I provide really quick and we'll jump straight into this reading. I provide a protection bubble that covers you with the blood of Jesus. It prevents any harm, danger, or evil coming towards you for 90 days for $22. I also have a family protection bubble bundle which is for one adult and up to four children. We still got to keep our children protected against molestation, abuse, bullying, generational curses. This protection bubble will come in handy for your children when you're not around to give them that extra protection. And it is for one adult and up to four children for $44. I also do cord cutting, which severs any ties to any unhealthy, toxic narcissists, ex-lovers, co-workers, neighbors, anybody that's not for your highest good, please Google the benefits of getting a cord cutting, and I'll do those for $55. I also do reversal spell work. I can remove curses, voodoo, hexes, black magic spell work, anything that has been done on you, I can send it back to sender right away. If you do not have any money whatsoever and you need special prayer, please leave in the comments detail of what you need the special prayer to indicate, okay? 
or you can sit up here and reach out to my email, which is innocencetarot at gmail.com. Once again, that's innocencetarot at gmail.com, okay? And I will enter you in the special prayer book. If you need any additional information about any other services, please feel free to reach out and um, I'll reach back, okay? So, um, yeah. So I just want everybody to know that I appreciate you being here at my channel. Thank you for everybody that supports me, that rocks with me each and every day, okay? And I really um, appreciate all the good, kind words that you guys say. I'm very blessed to be able um, to do something that I love, okay? And um, you guys, y'all just so special to me. And I just wanted to thank each and every one of you guys, okay? So, um, yeah. So make sure you push that like button. Subscribe, okay, from my heart to yours, okay, and we finna get up into it, okay, see what this deck is talking about, okay, because this deck is a little bit messy, okay, but you know we want to get knee deep in it, so all praises to God for letting us know what's going on behind the scenes, okay, so it looked like Divine Feminine, somebody sitting up here doing spell work on you, but you already knew that somebody was doing spell work on you, okay? Ain't, ain't nobody getting nothing past you, Divine Feminine, okay? You already knew that spell work was being done on you, and you ain't doubting your intuition or how you feel, okay? But just know that your ancestors got your back, okay? They got your back, okay? None of that spell work is sitting up here working, okay? And um, if you need me to sit up here and send it back to sender, please feel free to reach out because I'll make sure that musty mouth bitch get it right back, okay? But yeah, somebody been doing spell work on you, so stay prayed up, stay saged up, and definitely keep your vibration up, okay? That's all you have to sit up here and do, okay? There's no reason to sit up here and not be in doubt. Okay, well, you already know, okay? And it's somebody, it's one of your divine masculine options, or it's all these hating ass bitches sitting up here that teamed up against you doing spell work, trying to sit up here and hurt you, okay? You know how it, you know how enemies is. They'll team up with each other just to take a motherfucker out, okay? Let's keep it real, okay? But yeah, it's one of divine masculine options or all these fucking musty mouth bitches sitting up here doing spell work on you, okay? which is the truth, okay? You feel as though your divine master is extra fucking toxic. You feel as though he a player, and he don't want to sit up here and make the necessary changes, okay? But he kind of cute, okay? Mm -hmm. He kind of scrumptious, though. I can't okay, talk about he a player, really, okay? <laughs> he scrumptious, though, okay? Okay. <laughs> For real, but he toxic, okay, and he's still a player, okay. Your divine master said you first. I'm not making no moves to you know you know where to find me. Divine master still up in his motherfucking ego. He still don't feel like he needs to sit up here and do right by you. The bitches is steady sitting up here stroking his ego, and you refuse to chase, okay. You an empress. You're not finna chase his ass down, okay. When he already belonged to you, okay. That's just like. Just like what God told the devil, he said, I, the devil told him, I'll give you all this. And what did God say? Yeah, you're going to give me something that's already mine. So divine master, he ain't doing nothing. He just cutting himself off from your energy. Why he think he hurting you? Why he dealing with all these bum ass bitches wanting to be a player? Okay, you go right ahead, divine master. You go right ahead. Okay, mm-hmm. You go right ahead because Divine Masculine, he's so used to these motherfucking nothing ass bitches sitting up here stroking his ego, okay? That he done forgot what real love really is, okay? He don't want, he wants to have quantity than quality, okay? And that's where his ass went wrong, and that's where his ass continued to go wrong, okay? It's the truth. Divine Masculine out here sitting up here being a player and shit sitting up here not using protection with some of these bitches. Divine Master think he the shit, okay? But he thought wrong. Your Divine Master could have sat up here and count a STD because he he um don't like to use protection. And I hope that you was using protection with him. And then he fucking with all these nobody-ass bitches that's out here fucking everybody, okay? Looking stupid. Why he think he playing somebody, okay? Come on now, Divine Master. Okay? 
always sitting up here dealing with some fucking friends with benefits, always running back to his ex, always winking and blinking at anybody that will sit up here and give him some attention, okay? Divine masculine, ready to fuck, okay? It's too easy to score with your divine masculine. And um, if you decide to go back to his ass, please use condoms, okay? I doubt if, can he fit a magnum? Because, you know, magnums for extra large men, okay? Hmm, is he? I don't know. But, um, yeah, he out here with friends with benefits, okay? Study sitting up here, want to be unchanged, want to sit up here and tell you that you know where to find him when he done fucked over you and everything. But guess what? Karma finna fucking come up on his ass, okay? Divine Master finna sit up here and end up going to fucking jail, okay? God finna sit Divine Masculine down, okay? He really is, okay? He don't know that the popo is sitting up here watching his ass, watching his ass real close, okay? That Divine Masculine gonna end up sitting up here going into the correctional, okay? Getting locked the fuck up because he being sloppy. He keep on occurring, uh, accumulating more karma. He got the nerve to be sitting up here being extra up in his ego. Study not sitting up here trying to change, not trying to apologize to you, not trying to do the right thing. And God is tired of Divine Masculine thinking that he going to be out here sitting up here sleeping with all these friends with benefits when he sat up here and mistreated an uh, empress, okay? He mistreated the empress for no reason for sex with um, benefits. Um, what they call uh, what they call friends with benefits. Okay, I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. And his ass is finna sit up here and end up getting it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. God tired of divine masculine and his dumb dumb ass shit that he like to fucking do. Okay. God said you will not sit up here and mistreat the empress and you will not continue to be out here sitting up here sleeping with all these nobody ass bitches mistreating the empress. Okay. God said, uh uh. God said she is protected by her ancestors. Okay. She an empress. Okay. You will put some respect on her name. Okay. You ain't got to like her, but you damn sure gonna respect her, okay? And your ancestors and God is sick and tired of how he treats you, how he been doing you, and he finna get his ass sat down, okay? Popo is watching his ass extra heavy, okay? And he he knows something is coming. I'm pretty sure he can't sleep, okay? Your divine masculine could be registered as a sex offender, okay? Could have a sketchy background, okay? on dealing with people, dealing with underage women or something, okay? Who knows, okay? Or the popo uh, watching him, okay, because somebody that made some allegations about him, who knows, okay? But, but I don't know if Divine Masculine told you that he was married, okay? This karmic acting like she want to get marriage counseling and shit, but all along her ass like the same sex, okay? She a carpet muncher. She like the same sex. She really into you. She don't hate you like she say she hates you. She really want to taste you. She really want to know what that honey bun is all about, okay? Why she's sitting up here acting like she want to hold on to divine masculine, okay? This bitch like straight coochie, okay? She do, okay? And she and she like a like a dog in heat, smelling and knowing that you've been marinating and celibate, okay? She really wants you, okay? This karmic got a dark past, okay? She done done a whole lot of different things, okay, that she ain't kept it real to Divine Masculine about, okay? It looked like Divine Masculine, he say that he loved you, but it looked like he could have shocked you. He could have shocked you. He could have sat up here and ghosted you, okay? Living a double life with this karmic, study acting like he wasn't with this karmic, okay? Acting like he was over there for a kid, but really wasn't over there for a kid. He was really in a full relationship, living a double life, okay? Even though each and every day he was saying that he loved you, okay? It was shocking when you found out all the different things that your divine masculine was doing behind your back, okay? It was shocking, heartbreaking. And this motherfucker acted like he was so loyal and he was so in love, okay? And this motherfucker sitting over there with a whole family, okay? With a whole family in another relationship while he started telling you he loves you, okay? Your divine masculine was even talking about getting married, okay? Your divine masculine, you were just shocked. I'm saying, 
Okay, because this man, he was studying, sitting up here, telling you how much he loves you, telling you how much he want to be with you. And this motherfucker sat up here, was talking about marriage, okay? And could have sat up here and went and married the next bitch, okay? On the way he promised you, okay? It's the truth. But Divine Master said uh, he loved you, but he said he would sit up here and protect his family at all costs, okay? Who he, who he, His baby mama, okay? Who he got a family with, who he got a double life with, okay? He made that choice, okay? Even though he loved you, he made the choice that he would sit up here and stay with his baby mother. She could have recently had another baby. She could be finna have another baby, okay? They could have two kids, okay? New baby or what? But what I do know is that he decided to ghost you, even though he loved you, to be over here in a family dynamic with this karmic, okay? You see what the, you see what it say, okay? Okay, I'm talking about he love you, but he can't sit up here and give up his family, okay? Up here living a double life, playing with people's hearts and shit, while he all alone sitting up here talking about he love you, but not knowing it's a t he he twist to the shit. This bitch is into bitches, okay? That's what she into, okay? But it's all right, Divine Feminine, because you're going to end up here in the T, okay? You're going to end up here in everything that's been going on in the background. Somebody going to call you up and tell you some shocking ass shit, okay, that you ain't going to be able to believe, okay? Mm -hmm. And that's the T, too, that she really more into females than she is into Divine Masculine, while he over there being super faithful to this hoe trying to be unchanged, okay? But that's karma, wanting to be a player, and her ass is over there being a fucking player, too, while he over there being a player, okay? Just two toxic-ass motherfuckers, okay? But Divine Feminine, you ain't tripping, okay? Divine Feminine, you sitting up here escaping, okay? You escaping the bullshit and the abuse and everything, and you getting the fuck on, Okay? They thought that you wouldn't do it. Divine Master thought that you wouldn't get sick and tired of being tired and you wouldn't bounce. And you did. You set up here, got the running. You got the running like how Tina Turner ran up out that damn um, hotel trying to get away from Ike in that movie. Okay, you got the fuck on, okay? And you knew that you are doing it, okay? You seen the strength within you to walk away from the bullshit. And you got the fuck on, quickening the hairy, okay? And you looking good now, okay? Getting your sexy bag, okay? Just really feeling yourself. And Divine Master, he's going to feel like the fool, okay? He is, okay? Mm-hmm. Because what Divine Master can understand is that God's trying to bless you, okay? You finna be in the spotlight, okay? You finna really attract a real good soulmate to you, okay? And he going to love you, especially that body girl, okay? It's the truth. Your divine master, he out here secretly dating a stripper. Some bitch that like to trick out here and be escorts and a stripper and doing all type of shit. He dating one of those type of bitches, okay? That's one of the fucking options that he dating, okay? He loves sitting up here dating bitches that nobody else want to wife, okay? He always want to come and be the cleanup man, okay? They showing up with dick and bubble gum, pussy and bubble gum. He showing up with dick and bubble gum, okay? Your divine masculine is attracted to toxic ass relationships. He love being in toxic ass bullshit. He get a thrill, a high from the shit, and it just turns you off, divine from mm -mm. No, because you finna sit up here and attract good news, divine from Okay, a good man is finna come that God has sent for you. Okay, that you've been praying for. Okay, you about to attract this man into your life. Okay. And here come your divine masculine want to sit up here and come back and kiss your ass, okay? Even though you've been in a toxic relationship, he smell a new man on the horizon. Want to come back and ask you for your forgiveness and shit. Still not trying to change his toxic ass ways, though, okay? But trying to hate on this new soulmate that's coming, okay? But you feel as though life is too short. You taking the leap of faith, okay? And you're going to deal with somebody totally new, okay? You looking good. You feeling good, okay? And you got the strength to do so, okay? And you ready, okay? You open to a soulmate. You just want to be loved properly, okay? You want to be treated right, and you deserve to be treated right, okay? 
Divine Feminine said, even though I want to sit up here and deal with somebody, she said, I still am a, sing, um, a, a single mom, so let's not go too fast. I have trust issues, and I will protect my children with my life, okay? Divine Feminine ain't playing. She said, I want to date, but she want to take her time and be able to get to know this person before she fully invests in them, okay? And that's really good, Divine Feminine. So proud of you. So proud of you, yes. Your, your strength is amazing, okay? Is amazing, okay? Yes. She love her kids. She love her kids, okay? If she got trust issues, she keeping it real. Straight up front, okay? She ain't playing no games, okay? Mm-hmm. But just know that this musty mouth fast bitch, okay, is sitting up here watching you, stalking you, okay? This bitch is a keyboard thug. She right there sitting up here watching everything, okay? Because this bitch know that she finna lose the relationship she has with Divine Masculine or she finna lose a loved one because this bitch continues to sit up here and do um, spell work on you and everything. And this shit is bouncing about for you and right back to this bitch, okay? Upside up on it, okay? For real. What else is going on? Hold on, let me get this deck. Okay, mm-hmm. You could have been in a long-distance relationship with your divine masculine, and all of a sudden, he could have switched up on you, okay? You thought that your divine masculine was a good man, okay? His ass wasn't, okay? He could have this type of dog, okay? Or you finna sit up here and meet a man with this type of dog, okay? Divine family, you sitting up here taking your power back, okay? Let me turn this so you can read it. You taking your power back, okay? You moving forward with your life, okay? This karmic, she said that she in a love triangle. She got divine masculine in a love triangle and been seeing someone else. And she having um, trouble on choosing who she really want to be with. Divine masculine, he about to get ghosted by this karmic that he played you for, okay? Trust. Next door neighbor interfering in your relationship, after your man or wife, okay? You got a neighbor that's sitting up here watching and trying to sit up here and get to your man. You could have lost divine masculine to a neighbor, okay? But be aware of what you're saying, what you're doing, and what you're communicating to this neighbor because she's not for your highest good, okay? Earn it. Paying for affection of a man, okay? Divine Masculine be paying for affection from other men just to stroke his ego, to hang out with him and shit. Okay, your divine master sitting up here acting like he unbothered when he really sitting up here in a gang of pain, hurting, crying, and doing all type of shit, but trying to act like he unbothered. Okay, when he really is. Okay, silent moves. I'm making moves in silence. Don't want anyone to ruin my plans. Making an offer you can't refuse. Okay, so divine master said that he moving in silence. He finna sit up here and come and make an um, offer to you, but he just ain't saying shit, okay? He said, silent moves. I'm making moves in silent. Don't want anyone to ruin my plans, making an offer to you that you can't refuse. Boy, bye. But he up here acting like he unbothered. You telling me if a person is making moves and doing this and that, he can't communicate with you, still be right, okay? Mm -mm, don't believe the hype, okay? Your divine master study keeps sitting up here reaching out to you, but he taking. He married, he in a commitment, he lived with somebody, he's taking. Your divine master could secretly be dating a transgender, okay? A, a man that likes to dress up as a woman. This could be one of his secrets that he's keeping, okay? This karmic, she has revenge sleeping with, with the homie or a family member. This karmic is sleeping with somebody close to him, and she don't give a fuck, okay? Divine Masculine know that he know he knows that you know that he's taken and this is why you stop sitting up here waiting. Stop waiting for him to sit up here, reach out, come back. You no longer care. You're just at the point of healing and acceptance, okay? Okay, Divine Masculine said grass is greener. I need time to see if there's more romantic options, okay? Divine Masculine said he still want to be out here winking and blinking at bitches, okay? He said he want to sit up here and 
have his ego um, stroked and everything and, and study want to sit up here and see if the grass is greener over there. But yet yeah, he's sitting up here want to sit up here and ask you for forgiveness and come back and kiss your ass, okay? Mm -mm. This is why you're no longer waiting for Divine Masculine. You feel as though he would never sit up here and change his fucking ways, okay? He taken. He out here with the karma. He's in love with you, but he's study dealing with all these options. And you ain't got time to be waiting on the bullshit, okay? No. Divine Finn said, I am manifesting a brand new person, a brand new life. And she said that she trusts God and know that God is going to deliver, okay? Divine Feminine is not sitting up here walking on sight. She knows she walked by faith, not by sight. She knows it's coming. She manifested, and she's open to receiving, okay? That's what Divine Feminine is, okay? Dating. I'm back on the dating scene and making an effort to move on, okay? Divine Feminine is on the dating, um, back on the dating scene, okay? Or your Divine Masculine could be sitting up here leaving the karmic and trying to be back on the dating scene, okay? Use your intuition, divine feminine, okay? Or your divine master needs to start using his intuition and stop letting other people tell his ass what he need to do. He needs to make up his own mind and use his intuition, okay? Advice from a wise counselor. You're going to be able to hear something from a wise person, okay? Or divine masculine needs to sit up here and take heed, okay, on listening to someone that is wise, okay? Deceit. I'm going to whip yo, I'm going to whip somebody's ass, okay? Divine feminine, you feel like whooping this bitch ass. You feel like dragging this bitch. You really feel like really putting hands and feet on this bitch. You really want to give her a unicorn. You know we can get that knot right in the middle of your fucking head when you don't fuck somebody up and drag them, yeah. That's what you really want to do, but you just continue to keep it cute, okay? Because you know that your kids is depending on you. That's the only reason why you won't just go fuck her ass up, okay? Workaholic passion has been lost in the relationship, okay? You and your divine masculine used to be cool and have fun, but the passion has been lost with all his lies and deception, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it used to be cool. And he and he's sitting up here reminiscing, having flashbacks on the good times, but knowing that he done fucked over you, want to sit up here, come and kiss your ass and ask you for your forgiveness. Only you see I'm not seeing anyone else, anyone if that's what you're wondering, okay? Your divine masculine acting like he wasn't seeing nobody else while he was all up in your bed and spending the night at your house and shit, and he was just out here just a straight hoe. Okay, a straight hot pocket out here, lying. Okay, fertility with boy or without, you are viable and and you matter. Okay, divine family, you matter if you have a kid. If you don't, you gotta know that God is gonna fill your cup. Divine masculine want to sit up here and ask you to marry him. He feel like that's one of the ways that he can get you back in his life. Okay, divine masculine said lost. Losing you was devastating. I know now you were my karma, okay? Divine Masculine said he feel devastated knowing that he fucked up and feel as though he needs to come in and ask you to marry him, wishing that he would have sat up here and listened to his intuition, but fucked up, okay? Now he's seeing that he getting karma for how he did you. He feel like the only way he can make it right is ask you to marry him. Stocking, oh yeah, I'm smashing the wedding, you you were mine first, and if I can't have you, no one, no other bitch will, okay? What the hell? This is stocking. Oh, yeah, I'm smashing the wedding. You were mine first, and if I can't have you, no bitch kid, okay? This bitch said if you and Divine Master was to get married, she would sit up here and come and fuck up the wedding. This bitch is so thirsty, so extra, okay? And she can't take the fact that Divine Master want to sit up here and marry you, okay? She can't take the fact that Divine Master want to separate, okay? She know that Divine Master want to marry you. She know that you the Empress, but this hating ass bitch won't stop, okay? Even though Divine Master has separated away from this bitch, she's not willing to accept it. She knows it's on the horizon. Oh, yeah, this bitch know that separation is coming, okay? Because God's going to have his way, okay? It's a lot of divine unions that's going to come in, okay? And if you don't end up being a, um, with divine masculine, you damn sure going to be with a high-level soulmate. And that's still a divine union as well, okay? Bitch, since you already know about me, let's set a schedule so 
schedule when Big Daddy is free, okay? This bitch says she know about you. She still want Big Daddy to come through, okay? Sister Sledge, we are family celebrating, okay? But your spirit guys said they going to choose up with you. You ain't got nothing to worry about, okay? Keep moving forward, okay? We still got time. Let's see. Let's see what this bitch is doing behind the scenes, okay? We're going to use the Karmic Tales 3. Let's go up here and see what this crazy bitch is doing. What is this karmic doing, Lord? What is this karmic doing? She extra guarded from past issues. This bitch suffers from a lot of anxiety and a lot of depression, okay? This is why her ass continues to want to fuck with you, okay? Yeah, divine masculine, okay? Is making her sit up here and feel very anxious because he pulling back. He ain't one to deal with her. Okay, what else? She said that she needs ex external um, validation. She always needs divine masculine to make her feel like she's important. Okay, this could be a Sagittarius that is sitting up here feeling worthless, feeling hurt. Okay, this karmic and Sagittarius in her chart. Okay, somewhere. Okay, this karmic. Okay. She hates sitting up here, divine feminine, okay? She got Aquarius in her on her chart, okay? She hates divine feminine, okay? And she sit up here burning through money, okay? She burning through money trying to keep up with divine feminine, okay? You could be dealing with what well, this karmic is Aquarius. She got Aquarius in her chart somewhere, Sagittarius too, Okay, this karmic is sitting up here walking around with a sexually transmitted disease. This bitch is heartless. She don't care if she gives it to divine masculine. She don't care if divine masculine give it to you. She don't care. She wants everybody else to hurt because she got a sexual transmitted disease. Okay, and she's heartless. Okay, she will on purpose let divine masculine come and have sex with you, knowing that she gave divine masculine an STD. Okay, your divine masculine is currently with an STD. If you decide to take him back you better make sure that he gets checked out and you can go to the emergency room and get the results in the same day it's gonna be a while but you get the results okay because divine feminine you sitting up here trusting god okay letting god lead yourselves okay knowing that god is gonna sit up here and balance the scales okay you know that you know that okay you do that okay you trust the spirit divine feminine knowing that god got you you ain't got no worries okay and knowing that everything and that people thought that you didn't see god did okay what else okay speaking the truth this bitch ain't got the truth in her she's sitting up here getting tarot readings to be able to sit up here and get the truth of what's happening with divine feminine okay and divine masculine this karmic is binge watching tarot readings to be able to get all the information that she needs okay this is what she's doing okay this bitch feels as though this bitch is empty inside this bitch is sitting up here doing black magic spell work okay this bitch is sitting up here doing the most okay feeling hopeless feeling empty inside feeling like the only thing that she can result to is black magic and spell work right now okay she is emotionally unavailable she continues to keep choosing people that are unavailable okay she really needs some therapy okay Taken for granted and used and abused. Emotional labor one side, okay? She feel emotionally abused. She feel as though divine masculine plays a lot of fucking games with her, okay? And this is what the made her set up here and feel extra hopeless, okay? Because divine masculine 